Good morning, YouTube. Well, it's a beautiful April 1st, 2018 up here in Northern California. It's early and I'm suited up and booted up getting ready to get some good spiritual nourishment because the body needs that too, right? But I wanted to get on here and address our, our lead vendor friends that are overseas and they're, you know, just call me daily wanting to offer me their leads, wanting to go behind my back with my buyer. And this is, this is for you guys. Look, um, if I go out in the marketplace and say that we have the number one lead quality, the only reason we say that is not to be arrogant. It's not to be a punk. It's really to share with people what we've been working on for a long, long time. I focus more on skills. I focus more on cycles and processes. And I know a lot of people out there just, it's all about the leads and leads and leads and they're chasing down the, the mythical lead, right? But there's no, so, there's no perfect lead. But there is one for us that we've perfected over the years. Um, and I've been in marketing 14 years. I've sold burial insurance for 14 years. But in alongside of my career, I had the, the, the great privilege of being able to generate television marketing with my friend JR and Golden Memorial, which just blew up. Um, I've had extensive experience in 2010. I started learning how to cold call. So before I was even a final expense telesales agent, I was cold calling, generating leads for my field organization in 2010. And that's where the favorite color came into place. We started working with that in 2010 and it just worked, you know. Uh, we were selling leads to a telephone organization. I was writing a lot of business, good friend of mine, Dan, and a few other guys in the marketplace in 2010. The point is that <clears throat> being that that's been my, ex my experience, I got a good grip on what a good lead is. And a good lead isn't a lead that buys every single time, right? It's, of, it's, it's, it's mainly of somebody that is truly interested in receiving information or a quote for burial insurance. And, you know, with my background, not only did I know how to generate leads, guys, but I was a door knocker. I was a producer. My whole career, I've been a producer. Always. That gives me an insight that most of you guys don't have or will ever have because you guys are not insurance agents. So if you're a lead vendor and you claim that you have the number one lead, how do you base that on? When you don't have consistent lead orders week after week after week, when you have mountains and mountains of refunds from unsatisfied insurance agents that don't want to pay you, or if they paid you, they went and canceled the credit card. That sucks. So why send me the agent and in return, I'll send you the invoice? Why? Because the problem that you have, Mr. Lead Vendor, is that you don't have consistent clientele and you don't have the right group of people that know how to sell. If you had a group that knew how to sell, you can use that testimonial to deal with some of these agents that don't. And I promise that if you send over those agents to us, whether it's a field guy or a telephone guy, we will train them. And by us simply training them and show them what we do every day, because I sell every day, man. I'm on the phone daily training my people. I promise you, we're not going to get no refunds on the leads. Then you're going to have a consistent order every week. Is it going to cost you a little bit to work with me? Yes. Absolutely. I'm not doing it for free. Because I know one thing, that all you lead vendors out there are wanting more business. Well, here's your chance. Okay? We're looking for legitimate organizations in your country. You better be vetted out good. We got legal representation globally. Pakistan, Philippines, South America, we got legal representation. 
So if you're thinking just because you live in another country, we can't touch you, you're wrong, man. Especially with the administration we have right now with Mr. Trump. He's backing us up. We walk into an embassy in any city and we can touch you, man. So we want to make sure who you are. We want everything in writing. We want to make sure that you haven't had any FCC complaints. You haven't done anything wrong because a lot of vendors, unfortunately, what they're doing is they're just buying leads from one to another and not even caring about what the law in the United States of America says. So it's a great opportunity for the right guy, the right company that's been playing ball right. If you haven't, don't even bother calling us. Also, if this interests you, call my buyer, Chris Martin. Chris has been with me for over a year. He was humble enough to drop down his pride, drop the briefcase. And in the process, we helped him become the number one lead vendor selling burial insurance leads. Not only that, but he's selling more and more leads on a weekly basis to our marketplace simply because we are showing them how to sell. So if it interests you, give Chris a call. He's my buyer. I'm not going to answer any of you lead guys. You guys bombard me all the time. Listen to what I'm saying. I'm not trying to be rude. Just follow what I'm telling you and we'll do something. But if not, if you're calling me and you're insisting, I take that as disrespect because you're not watching my marketing. You're, you have another, another agenda. Anyways, guys, you guys enjoy this beautiful Sunday and see you guys at the top. Bye.